Hey guys, this is Storm from Swarm Unity, and I'm bringing you guys a video on a tutorial on how to make 3D vector ribbons in Illustrator. And I first got the idea of making this video when I uh, opened up my issue of uh, How Magazine for this July, and I saw a um, an infographic uh, part, an article on how to make infographics and the header was a ribbon like this so I decided to try to make my own so um, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make a 3D ribbon so you want to start by making a new document um, and I will set my width and height to 2560 by 1440 because that's my desktop size and now that we have that open, um, you want to start by going to shapes. Just had it. Here it is. And start by making a rectangle. Your choice on size. I like to make mine more skinny. And I guess it doesn't matter what color you want yours, but I'm going to make mine green. Actually, I'll make it red. Okay. So, <clears throat> you want to make it kind of light for your rectangle. Like that. And then you want to take your pen tool and go to the edge. It should lock in and like uh, lock to the point and then you want to make a triangle like so and you want to color it dark this is going to be the darkest part and then you want to drag that over object transform reflect vertical and there you go and then what I like to do is hold alt and grab this and then just make it smaller and then you want to attach the corner underneath to the triangle corner and as you can see it kind of blends in and put that underneath and uh, what you do is you make it lighter than the triangles but darker than the other one like so and this part is the hard part I guess if there is a hard part but you want to take your star tool and if it's not already set to triangle it should be set to this as a default, the star, and you just want to press your arrow keys and you get to decide on how many points there are. So you want three, because they don't necessarily have a triangle tool. So grab a fairly big triangle, and I'll color it blue just to know where it is, and turn it sideways like that. And then you want to make it so it's in the middle of your uh, bottom rectangles. And then you want to select both um, the triangle and the bottom rectangle and click minus front. That should leave you with this, which you can then drag underneath like so. And then drag that corner and object transform reflect like that so as you can see we have a nice spanner and if you extend it like that it still looks kind of nice you um, there's a point where it doesn't look like uh, look that nice like that but you can make it look pretty nice I like to keep mine skinny though 
Okay. And so since it's vector, what you can do is take it, copy it, and you can choose different colors. So I'll do a nice cyan. Like that. And as you can see, it looks really nice. And yeah. So this has been a tutorial on how to make 3D vector ribbons. If you liked it, you can subscribe for more videos like so, uh, and gaming videos too. So graphic design and gaming. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. Bye.